Good evening, good evening, good evening. Hello one and all. Welcome, welcome, welcome to everyone who is stumbling across my channel for the very first time. And if it is your first time, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Grace from Diamond Paint with Grace. Pleased to meet you for all those coming back and welcome back, welcome back. We are going to keep going with our storage solution hunt uh, because you know here in the great old land of Oz we don't get the great opportunities for all the f I was gonna say free you know they're not free for the cheaper or more cost-effective craft solutions or craft storage solutions or even supplies anything you like um, from overseas we always seem to get um, mm, yeah no it's not it doesn't work out well for us it doesn't work out well for us however i have been doing an immense amount of research and i've come up with my second look look amazon prime it's from amazon so um i will um open this up with you guys today i'm on the hunt i'm on the hunt i'm determined to find something that's affordable not only for my aussie uh subscribers out there but also i mean if it's on amazon that means it's also available for you guys all around the world speaking of which if you are new to my channel or if you have been watching a couple of videos and you're yet to let me know where you're watching from can you hear that my motorbike <gasps> rude <laughs> um if you're yet to let me know which part of the world you're watching from please do pop it down in the comments below and that, and that way i can add you to my next world map video roll call which I am collating a list. Boy, that list is getting big. And I'm so excited, I can't wait to do that next video. Uh, shall we get onto the table? If you're yet to hit the subscribe button though, please do consider doing that and becoming a part of my diamond painting world. You'll find it in that corner down there. I know, right? You're impressed. Those that have been around for a while, you know what I'm talking about. I did it without hesitation. It's down. <laughs> next to that is a notification bell it's shaped like a bell true i promise you it is which will go ding each and every single time i upload a new video and that means you get a ting as well i just said that didn't i that sounded really weird uh, again new to my channel that's okay deal with deal with me that's how it is it's going to be raw organic whatever comes out comes out however it comes out comes out in the meantime let's flick the camera around you don't want to be looking at this anymore and Let's get into this package. Come on, guys. Oh, bit of free DNA. Did you see that? That was just not nice. Come with me, guys. Come on. Hello, guys. Hello. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. A queen. A queen. A queen. That is not really good Englishes at all, is it? Oh my goodness. I should actually. What I'm going to do is here in this section here. Editing Grace. Did I just say editing Grace? Gracie. Uh, she's going to put in here all the order dates, shipping dates, and delivery dates. Okay, so Grace, remember to put that here for the peeps. Uh, but this came really quick. This came really quick. And I'm trying to remember what it was. And because I've put a few through on Amazon, and I don't know what which one this is. Funny about that. With that being said, before I continue, I do want to say, I do want to say a very big thank you to my Patreons and also to those who have uh, given me super chats and, and stickers and things throughout the lives again this is what uh, that money is going towards it's in order for me to do the research and you know purchase products to share with you to see if it's something that would suit your diamond painting journey so let's see what's in this package now gentle reminder down i was going to say downstairs <laughs> funny I make a good funny down in the description not downstairs but down down in the description down there right I'm going to link the video uh, that I did on my Elizabeth Ward I know right I know uh, how excited was I in that video and mind you I just taped that last time I don't know when it's gonna go up I don't know when this one's gonna go up but uh, we, I'm going to just do these videos as the products come in so uh, I'll link it down below. I'm not going to go through this again, but this is my current storage system. Okay, my Kmart storage system. Loving it, loving it, loving it. I'll link all the relevant videos for you to um, to view, or uh, if I remember, I'll put them up in the eye. I'm really hopeless at putting them up in the eye, 
I'll, but I will try to put them down there. And if I do forget someone, please do tell me. Let's not waste any more time. Let's not waste any more time. Let's see. Now, you know why I'm on the hunt? I am determined. Determined, guys, determined. Because, you know, I see so many people talking about the Harbour Freight containers, which are uh, available in the US, but not overseas. I'm feeling something. Is there an invoice? No. <gasps> oh, is there an invoice? No, there isn't. Ooh, are we close? There's something in here. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. Well, that just sucks. I need to find these, but with free shipping because it costs me more for the shipping than for the containers. Oh, sorry, guys. You were completely out of shot there. This is what I have found. Now, just to let you know, this is a 40-pack. They cost me $11.97 for 40, which I thought, you know, well, without even opening them, um, we'll find out. But the shipping... Dying. I don't know where my eyes were when that happened. The shipping was $16.72. So in total for 40 of these, it cost me $28.69. Mm, definitely not comparable to your Harbour Freights, which is like, what is it, four or five bucks and you get them all in a nice clip container and stuff. But anyway, let's see what these are like. Supposed to get 40 of them. Oh, they're in, okay, all right, okay. So it came in that and they're again wrapped up. So I'll be curious to see what these are like. Let's have a look. They're very flimsy. They do clip shut. They're very, very flimsy though. That I think over time will go. I think it will go, but you know, if you're gentle enough with them, so what do we get? Let's have a look, see, we build Lego here together, aren't we? You're probably better off seeing them as they are. But let's have a look. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten of these littler ones. So they're your little confetti colours. They're not too bad, but really cheapy, cheapy, yeah? Like they're, just be gentle, I suppose. They are clipping quite nicely though. Is that light even working for you guys? Jeez Louise, that's a bit better. All right, then we get onto these ones. I'm not, I knew that these were different sizes and given the way that I'm seeing them packed in here, it looks like they can be done so that they end up being some sort of uniform way. So, you know what, that's not too bad. It's not a bad size. One, two, it's very thin, it's very, it's very thin, very, you know, it's your L cheapy, it's, you know, if you were going to be putting an order in for these at $11 and the $16 for the um, postage, I'd probably be ordering a few sets, to be honest. Or see if you can find someone on Amazon that sells the same one that's got free postage. Is there any such thing as free postage? I don't want to talk about postage right now. I'm a little bit upset. My Patreons, you know why I'm upset. I might even get to talk about it with everyone on a whip and chat. But anyway, we're going to talk about postage another day. But look at this. Look at this piece. So that's those ones there. Let's check out. Did we see these ones? So we've seen these. And we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 of those. And then how many of these? 
Let's see if I can open it the right way. I think this one, from what I've seen only on uh, videos from everyone else, uh, I think this one seems to be the, the most closest to your Harbour Freight. Maybe, am I, would I be right or wrong? Uh, so if I can find a bulk lot of this size, again, I didn't bring my tweezers, um, but that does seem to be closing okay. We're gonna do, we're gonna see how many diamonds that we can fit. And then we've got, are these all the same size? Yes, they are. So we've got those, look at that. Now, Look at that. What have I got here? These ones here. These are big mamas. Okay. Definitely enough room to put this, you know, your stickers along here. Definitely enough room to put your stickers along underneath each of the hinges. Or if you wanted to be a bit smarter and maybe do them on the side. You could do that too, like turn them all on their sides rather than having them underneath here. Yeah, whatever works for you, really. But I want to get out one of our, which, which one of my containers has got a lot. Let's go, who's gonna be our volunteer today? We're going to go for 8.95. Yep, from my diamonds that have been put away from Call of the Wild, so. Let's have a look at how these go. Now, um, let's start with the smallest one. So, out of this much, which these are quite big, these jars, these are really quite big. And this one, I would say, is ticking just over half, not quite three quarters, or maybe about three quarters. And that's a lot of diamonds. So that, oh, of course it's gonna happen. Can you, did you see that? Of course that's gonna happen when I'm, let's just put them back in here, shall we? Of course that's going to happen. Okay. All right, that holds, that took about, Oh, just under half of what was in there. So that's a considerable amount of diamonds. I'm just seeing how they kind of float around in there. They seem to be okay. And then of course, you know, I don't have, oh, oh, be mindful of that. Look at that. Okay, I wasn't even watching and they just vomited everywhere. Okay, oi, oi, oi. All right, all right, Gracie, don't panic. Don't panic, stop panicking. Oi, oi, oi. This is why I brought this monkey out. That is a lesson right there. Oh, I'm just not doing this well at all, am I? I've overfilled this. I'm not used to having so many diamonds in a tray like this, so that's a lesson there again. Come on. Come on, little monkeys, go back home. You're the sacrificial lambs today. Look at you, look at you, decorating my, and you gotta love my table because I've got so many diamonds that I pick out of these grooves. Oh my goodness, it's like, it's going to be a dinner party game. Come on guys, come for dinner and clean my table. Pick out all the diamonds. <laughs> all right, let's, oi vey. <sighs> I wonder if I've got 895. I bet you I don't, right? 890. 895, I do. See, I've got 895 here, but if I try and put that in here, I'm gonna end up with an open bag and I'm just not gonna be loving life after that. So I don't wanna open a bag just for the sake of opening a bag. But I do want to go through that again and see what I did wrong because if I did it wrong, I want to make sure that you guys don't do it wrong. So let's put some diamonds in. We've closed it. 
Okay, that's fine. You know, we've got it sitting there. It's in our, I'm gonna get something out to show you where I'm gonna store these when I'm using, pardon me, using them. All right, so the mistake that I must have made is I must have had it open like that. See when I opened it, how there's diamonds sitting up in there? Can you see, see that? Where's something that I can point with? See these here? Right? So that's what my mistake was. So it would be a case of just tapping them and making sure that they're not going to be caught up in that ledge. Then, of course, I would open them, tip them out, diamond paint away, and then when it comes time for putting them back, I would put them back. Okay, all right, I can deal with that. So lesson learned, if you get these guys, just be mindful. Now, obviously this step wouldn't be taking place, would it? But Okay, so we know roughly what that fits. Uh, I'm gonna say, I wonder which one's bigger. I wonder which one's bigger. Let's find out. Well, that just took a whole bunch and then some. When I close that, see how that's not fully closed here? Now it is, okay. So look, you get what you pay for. See how long they last. Um, again, you'd wanna make sure that nothing gets caught up there in the top before you open them. And then you pour them out as required. Close them and off you go. Okay, all right. Um, so that took that much. That that took a whole bunch, and there was still room, right? So that was that's half. That's half. Whereas this was just tipping, ticking over half. So this is already bigger than this. Oh, in volume. So I like that. Rather than going back in the jar, let's see how it goes in here. Is it the same? Is it bigger? Is it smaller? Okay, we can tell straight away. Oh, I reckon it's the same. See that, when I level that out, when I'm looking at it, yeah, like I'm looking at it on this angle, you're not gonna get the same sense. It's half. So they're just, because of the different, you know, give, what is it, take from Peter, give to Paul. So you, that's shorter here, but it's taller here. So I reckon volume for volume, they're going to be the same. It's just gonna come down to what is your preferred um, size to play with, right? So as I said, I have never had an, a harbor freight, a harbor freight, <laughs> a harbor freight, container in my hands I just go by what I see other creators use and this they either look it's one of these two it's, or it's an in-between of these two I don't know um, and when I was doing my hunt around see how that's stuck there it's a bit of static starting to happen now um, these were the closest so far that I found I'm just spewing I'm so upset about that delivery price you have no idea no idea. All right, so let's have a look at these big mummers now. These are going to take a crawl. That's a lot of diamonds. That's not even, that's about a quarter full. A quarter full. So that's a lot of diamonds. There for your big bags, okay? That's a lot of diamonds. So I am going to see if I can find, now that I know, the sizes that I can play with. Um, some more of these ones and some more of these ones. I don't know that in any given canvas I would have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I would have, you know, ten colours that are going to have, you know, more, that many diamonds to have to, to worry about. So bear with me because I'm going to go run and get what it is that I am planning to put these in when I'm actually diamond painting so don't go away okay so I've gotten a few bits and pieces out here let me put all this stuff back oh see I did it again see what I mean guys 
see? So if you get these, uh -huh. uh, if you get these, don't make that same mistake is what I'm trying to say. Uh, you're just gonna have to be mindful to remember just to give it a little shaky shaky so that you don't lose all your diamonds everywhere. And in putting them from container to container, there's probably a bit of static that's, you know, happened, but you know, we'll deal with that later. Okay, so click, click, yep. Alrighty. So, that's the, those ones. Okay, let's pop that over there. <coughs> so, what I had envisaged with these ones, actually, I'll, I'll show you this. Uh, Aussie Peeps, I bought this at Kmart. I'm going to be doing my Kmart haul in another video again, but keep an eye out for that and I'll tell you all about this good stuff um, however you don't need like if you're overseas just anything anything just improvise guys you just need to kind of think outside the square now when I bought these they came in containers okay the container and they came in containers that came with lids now what I'm thinking is put these in here like so somehow and then these would sit in you can't see what I'm doing doesn't work well when you can't see what Grace is doing does it okay so the thought process was to have them all the right way up because you know we want them all the way up to make them look pretty. Gotta make them look pretty. Okay, and then maybe, I don't know, I don't know. I'm just gonna go with the flow at the moment. Let's see if I can get them all in a nice row. Now this is for up to 40 colors. Why in the blazers I didn't get two of them at the time, I do not know, but anyway. Um, doesn't matter, doesn't matter. Maybe I thought to myself I would use this if there was a canvas that I was working on that had less than 40 colors. Maybe that was the thought process, who knows? Who knows? Um, put them there. That's one of them, that's one of these, and that's this one. And that doesn't look nice either. Hmm. Are you screaming at me yet going, Gracie, turn it the other way. If I turn it that way, maybe will it work better? where fun and games comes in and you kind of play Tetris with everything. True? True, people. The funny thing is, is that the way I kit up is I kit up in order of, um, what do you call it? In order of like one, you know, in numerical order of what's on the canvas because I'll look for the symbol, then I'll look for the number and then I just go straight to the number. That's how I... That's how I kit up. So that doesn't work well there either. Are these any shorter? Nope. That's oh, does it? No, it doesn't fit in there. Hmm. In any case, it's gonna have to work out somehow. They looked really pretty, all nice in there. Thing though, didn't they? I should have taken a photo of how that looked. <laughs> I'll have to go back and over the video, I think, and um, have a look at how they were all set out. 
Maybe that might work, Gracie. What if I do that like that? And then that like that. And then these babies. <gasps> By Jove, I think she's got it. Has she? Has she? Has she? Not hashish. I said has she. <laughs> um, close. Very close. No, that's not going to squeeze in there, and that's not going to squeeze in there. So we'll end up with three out there. <clears throat> okay. There's our three. <laughs> <coughs> but you can see what I'm trying to do there, right? So um, these, like I said, would end up being switched around. And this is where I struggle with, um, honestly, having different sizes because... The way that I kid up, like I said, mine are in numerical order, so I prefer them all to be uniform or at least, you know, in such a way that they will all fit properly. Because if I had to put, you know, a diamond up here that had all of this, but then it was followed by number two that only had that much, it's going to look really weird. It's going to look really weird in my head. So they're either going to be all uniform. So I might have to, you know, these will be good for something. I might use them for long-term storage for some reason. I don't know. Um, I, I can't see myself really using them, you know, for diamond painting. They're way too big. But I might investigate these sizes and get a crap ton of these. Or these, these thicker ones. Oh, come on, come out. Because then when I'm diamond painting... These will be the sizes that I will be gravitating towards the most. But, you know what? I'm happy to give them a whirl. I'm happy to give them a whirl. So, I'll put in here, if I haven't already, uh, the price that it was. Oh, I've already told you the price. Yeah, because I got stooged on the delivery. Damn that. $16.72. More than what the, the things cost. You know, 11 Eleven ninety seven for all of that wasn't a bad deal for forty pieces. I thought that's what I thought anyway. Um, it was the delivery that got me. So let me come back to you on that, guys, because I am certainly going to be hunting some more. I'm going to measure these out or go on the website and, or I'm on you know where I bought them, which I'll link below, and um, get these exact measurements out and maybe do a stockpile of these ones because these so far are the closest to my harbour freight hmm interesting 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 I mean I've got this here right I wonder you know where I'm going to go with this right so if I take that off I just feel that these will be too deep to sit in there. Oh, they're the same size, but the thing is, I don't, I don't work out of here. I work out of the tray here. But it would work. I could certainly put them in there. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. All right, guys. Well, that, my loves, is my second storage solution video brought to you by Amazon and my video hopefully hasn't stopped come on be nice for mama I don't know what's happening it's got a low battery signal there we go uh, brought to you proudly by Amazon Prime or Amazon Australia um, let me come back to you and see if I can find a cheaper website with or at least free to free delivery because nothing's for free these days as we all know but australia hold out hope i'm on the hunt i'm on the hunt okay i will get us there <laughs> um i will not be defeated and i will find us something okay uh still my kmart ones are still best value the plastic on these is way harder than these these are quite quite uh, like they're flexible like i can squish that uh 
couple of advantages and disadvantages. This would probably bounce when dropped. Uh, it would bounce, but because of the hinge and the cheapness of this, it's, it would probably splay open anyway. This, I feel if I drop this on my tiles, would just smash everywhere. So there's pros and cons to everything, guys. There's pros and cons to everything. Pros and pros and cons and cons. Oh, that didn't fit, did they? So they're my three here. They're gonna be my little stackable ones on the side. I can see already they're sort of getting a bit scratched up, but again, you know what? It's fine, it's fine. I'm dying to, I'm, as soon as I finish recording this, I'm gonna get online, you know that, right? You know, I'm not gonna be able to resist and find these sizes in bulk and at a good price because I'm determined I want I want to get maybe a set of 60 of each because I feel that that would be a good number for bigger because I do a lot of the big canvases so I feel that that would be a good size um, if I can get a set of 60 of those and a set of 60 of these oops and then I oh goodness gracious and then I can I can certainly um have a couple of paintings kitted up at the same time. I think that would work out really, really well. Okay. All right, guys. Well, thank you so much. If you've gotten to the end of this video, hey, hey, gold medal to you, gold medal to you, and thank you so, so much. Again, thank you to my Patreons and those who have sent super chats and stickers throughout my lives. Most, most appreciated. Uh, I'm guessing if this is available on Amazon Australia, it should be available overseas. I'm not too sure how it all works with Amazon. We've only had Amazon here, Amazon Australia for a few years, so I'm only new to it myself, to be quite honest. Anywho, wherever you are, I've got little, little teeny tiny indents in the bottom, so I guess if you wanted to stack them, you could, but I wouldn't rely on that. No, they're not, they're not anything, no. They're not going to stack and, and stay. So, no, don't rely on that. <laughs> um, I'm trying to do this goodbye to you, and it's like I don't want to say goodbye, friends. <laughs> oh, guys, look, honestly, if you've gotten to the end, thank you so much. I do appreciate you all. Yeah, please don't forget to hit the like button or the thumbs up button uh, on your way out. Please do make sure that you're looking after yourselves, that you are looking after each other, okay? Have a wonderful rest of your day, a fantastic rest of your week, okay? I am going to send you all much, much love, and <gasps> ciao, ciao for now.